Don't tell me your death stories. Don't tell me how the person didn't make it. I'm going to survive. And Susan G. Coleman was the source that I kept looking for information. And so I kept going there and I kept saying, I'm going to have to just advocate for every marginalized person because in the United States, one of the richest countries in the world, we should not have to have someone go bankrupt because you can't even afford your own medicine, medical care, transportation, hospitalization. Doing your self-exam is great, but you need to also schedule your mammogram. And now I'm glad that the age has moved up to 40, but the reality for health equity, it needs to be like 20 because people are getting triple negative breast cancer and they're dying. I've gone to more funerals of young black women who are dying because they get the diagnosis and it's too late. That's why I'm here. I'm here to tell the lawmakers that we need you as our partner and to give them the regulatory report language that they need so that they can negotiate in these subcommittees and we work with them and be bipartisan. This is about health. This is about health equity. This is about having the ability to breathe in in this wonderful free country and know that if you're sick, you don't have to go broke and you don't have to die. You can have help and you can have a partner in Susan G. Coleman.